All right, I'm going to walk you through creating a roundabout on Waze. Um, contrary to what you might believe, this is actually one of the easier editing functions on the client. Uh, don't really have to worry about figuring out connectivity or anything like that because it actually kind of just works for you. Uh, but there are a couple of tricks you kind of have to know, and I've just learned these by doing, I guess. Um, first of all, I found a suitable roundabout. This is Lee Circle in New Orleans. Um, we're going to turn on the aerial view so you can see the right size. And a lot of roundabouts, it seems, already have been kind of put into the map as streets. Now, I am going to delete these. And I guess it could be tough if you're not an area manager, but I digress. Get those out of the way. And then, fun thing about roundabouts, I'm going to edit the geometry so that all the segments are definitely going to be encompassed by the roundabout. just to be safe Let's see. Put that in there and here is the funny thing about roundabouts this is an orphan node there's nothing on it um, I'm not actually going to use that one because it would take forever to move it, but you know, I'm going to have to restart Cartouche. The thing about creating roundabouts is that you can use any node to do it. It doesn't have to be connected to anything. Just make sure the directions are right on all these streets and you're golden. So it turns into a roundabout. You can enter the radius over here in meters, or you can just drag this little guy to place you know everything where it's supposed to be and move it like this and hit create roundabout no no need to worry about connectivity no need to have the segments connected yeah and you just want to make sure that the circle you know the end of each segment you want in that roundabout is in that big circle okay I'm back I uh, have performed a trick and suddenly it worked so here's your roundabout. It's red, but don't let that put you off, because I've done it before. They work just fine in the client, regardless. It's not like some recorded road. It won't be red and all up in your face. And it'll route you. It'll tell you third exit, whatever, that kind of thing. Uh, and if you want, you give the roundabout a name. If the roundabout has a name which this one does. So, there it is. And it's not um, it's red anymore, but I mean, I can show you another roundabout which is still red and works just fine. So don't worry about naming it if you don't want to or if it doesn't have a name. There you go. You have a roundabout.